Welcome back everyone to Pokemon Light Platinum. The first thing I wanted to do was give a shout out to my buddy, the Dane Raw. His channel link is in my description. You please head on over there and give him some support. He's starting some LP series. He has a Minecraft up and uh, he'll need your help on a second one. So please go watch his videos. He is freaking hilarious. Give him your support. Yeah. Uh, in the meantime, all I found out uh, round 60 is a really good level to fight the Elite Four, actually. I have all these good items, and uh, yeah, I'm confident. Let's get through this crap. Probably do it before 30 minutes. Back to the ground guy again. Welcome to the Elite Four. I'm AZ. AZ? I use ground Pokemon. Yeah, 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 nobody cares. Let's go. Oh, waterfall. Well, I probably should have used whatever. Doesn't matter. Just kill him a surf. That works. Torterra, give me, um... Give me Arch Canine on this Torterra, and we'll lava surf the crap out of it. It's stupid, and it's not gonna use an Earth move. Wow. Okay, well, the Sipodon should easily go down to a waterfall. Oh, Fisher. Yeah, I don't want to run into that crap. <laughs> Hopefully you take down Hippodon quick, because, yeah. Oh, this Crocodile is the worst thing in this party, by the way, so unless you freaking... Yeah, uh, unless you take this thing down quick, it will freaking own you. So be very careful of, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, Crocodile. Hypnosis, motherfucker, thank you. Have a crunch. What, what do you mean you woke up already, freaking jerk? This thing's basically here to waste your H XP's, or, uh, PP, so, uh, get rid of him quick as you can, and use as little PP as possible, pretty much. And that's easy, pretty much. He is pretty easy. There's a lot of things in the Elite Four uh, that are just here to waste your power points. Which, of course, you need by the end. I mean, the Elite Four is hard enough as is without all your moves running out. So, let's see. The next one, I believe, is Water Type. So we're going to put Anubis out front. Yay, Anubis. See how many you can kill before he dies. Alright, Triton. Here we go. Blastoise. Oh, Pasha. Why do you still have Rapid Spin? It's such a crap move. It's even weaker than freaking Quick Attack, for God's sake. Oh, this Blastoise is an XP waster too, by the way. He likes to spam Protect. <coughs> Gyarados, probably the powerhouse, but it'll go down easy to an Electric Attack. Tentacruel, same. I think Tentacruel is just here to put up barriers and use Hydro Pump, but, uh... <coughs> yeah, Samurai! Go down easy to a Thunder, thank you. Waylord, his defensive wall taken down with an Electric Attack. And that's easy, old Triton. You have great skills! Yeah. I sure do, buddy. Triton's probably the easiest of the Elite Four if you have a half-decent electric type like I do, of course. And the next lady is, uh, I think this lady is dark type, so... What we're gonna do here... What should we do here? I'm gonna bring Sh uh, Goober out in front for this dark type. Until Umbreon comes out, of course, and I have a completely different strategy for him. Bam! Earthquake, mother freaker. Stupid houndoom. Scrafty. Yeah, get out of here, Starscream. Fly, mother freaker. Fly, mother freaker. Okay, this thing spams Focus Punch, so make sure and hit him often, because if you miss, you might be screwed. Okay, Hunch Pro, of course, take this thing out with an electric attack. No big deal. Yeah, Umbreon. Okay, here's Umbreon. And what I usually do for Umbreon is, um,. First of all, I'm going to put out spikes just to, you know, extra damage or whatever. And then I'm going to spam Rock Smash, because this guy is basically a uh, defensive power point wasting wall that likes to spam Fate Attack. So lower his defense as much as you can, because uh, it likes to spam Moonlight too, so yeah. Be very, very careful with this guy. He sucks. I hate Umbreon. Who do you think you are running around leaving scars? Jeez. Because, yeah, he's a power point waster, for sure. I'm going to go ahead and use a Hyper Potion. Yeah, if you have a fighting type here, obviously it would be a good idea to use him. But, yeah, okay, Umbreon's good. Absol. We'll use Goober again. Sounds like plan. Absol's hurt by spikes. Whoops, no, not sleep. God dang it. That's not good. Uh, I totally did that by accident. I gotta stop clicking so much. Okay, Arch Canine, use a lava surf. Okay, Absol. Yeah, uh, he'll probably send him out last, which is stupid because it likes to use Parasong, which means it'll end up losing the battle no matter what. So, yeah. 
Absol, not really that big of a threat. This whole Elite Four, if you're around level 60, really isn't that hard at all, honestly. Um, let's see, where's the Awakening? If you're underleveled, however, then you have a problem. I don't think I have an Awakening. I do have a full restore, however. Uh, but, since I doubt that I'm even really going to use Goober that much for the rest of the Elite Four, I'll put Shelly out in front. I forget what the next one- oh, dang, we're the champion already! Freaking nice. Alright, here we go then. Oh wait, no, that's the- this is the Iron Chick, okay. Uh, so she kind of does a little fake out maneuver and sends out her water steel first, so you're going to want to use an electric type. Uh, not a water type first, as you can see. Uh, yeah, okay, and then once you switch to your water type, it's pretty much home free from here. I mean, you can take out all the rest of her Pokemon pretty much with, uh, fire or, you know, water. No problem. This Bronzong's here to waste you. It's another PP waster, by the way. So, yeah. Uh, be aware of that. It's not too hard to kill, though, luckily. This Metagross, of course, is probably a little hard to kill if you're underleveled, but uh, if you have a Fire-type, shouldn't be a problem. Skarmory, same thing. Easy as that. And I'm just blowing past the Elite Four like nothing. Yep, that's right. Because I'm epic. Did anybody die in that battle? No. <laughs> Easy, man. The last... Three battles have been cake. Ugh, I might have even able to do this underleveled if I would have strategized enough. But it's that darn crocodile that that Earth guy has. Oh, anyways, uh, the next the champion coming up here has I think three dragon types, and then uh, the rest of us a mixed bag. I can't necessarily remember, but here we go. I knew I would get to face you the first time I saw you. I knew you had great potential. You really are good, but it's not time to face a real set. excuse me, the league champion. Alright, Calry's gonna send out this Charizard first, so make sure, of course, that you have a water type out. Because this thing's a beast even if you have a water type. I mean, it's a freaking Charizard, for gosh sakes. It also knows Dragon Rage, so don't think your high defenses are gonna save you. Ha, ah, Lucario. Okay, Lava Surf for the win. Lucario, of course, like I said, if you have a fire type, uh, shouldn't be a problem. This Rampardos, however, this, this, uh, may be a problem if you're ill prepared. Ah, which, uh, I might be here, actually. Ow. Okay, not a good idea. Let's go for Starscream. Fly! Yeah, this Rampardos is a beast. I think it's our best Pokemon, actually. Oh, crap, man. Really? What about, what about Shelly? Can Shelly do something against this thing? Okay, I guess it's partially ground-type or something. Okay, if Hoover can wake up, he might be able to do something against this thing. There we go. Okay, so I guess use water types on this thing, because that's probably the best thing you can do. Ow! God dang it. Thunder! Okay, good. Rampardos is dead. Okay, and she has three dragon types, uh, which I'm actually going to use uh, Max Revive on Shelly so we can take them all out. But that's what I need to do. Get out here, Shelly. I didn't count on that Rampardos being so strong, honestly. Uh, shoot. We use a revive on somebody else. Uh, shoot. Who should we use a revive on? Uber, I guess? Oh crap. Uh, that was a waste. Darn it. I guess we'll use another max revive on Shelly. Uh, this battle was actually fairly easy last time, which I'm surprised. I guess I wasted too much on her, uh, Rampardos, pretty much. And I just lost. fan freaking tastic so I will be right back once I get back to Kauri. Alright, here we go again, and I'll try to get it right this time, I swear. Uh, I mean, I beat this lady so easily uh, at one point, uh, the first time I went through this, and her guard charm just destroys me now, man. It's insane. Uh, this Rampardos is half the reason, though. Hate this Rampardos. Uh, if, you do have, if you have water attacks, though, it shouldn't be too hard. I believe it's, it's like, it's a really powerful, like, ground something. I can't remember, honestly, but, uh, yeah. Let's go for, whoops, Outrage, yeah, no fun. Uh, and this is where I use one of my Max Revives. As you can see, I have three again because, uh, my save cut up to me, of course. That was quick. Uh, Steel Wing. Okay, fine, do that way. Get out of here, Shelly. Ice Beam, Mother Freaker, thank you. Get rid of that Salamence. Haxorus, very dangerous. Make sure you get rid of him very, very quick. 
think he has even more defense in this version than he does in freaking black and white, which really sucks, believe me. Okay, so at least he's dead. And Garchomp's probably the worst thing on her team. As in, you know, worst as in obviously most powerful. Dang it, are you serious? Okay, get out here, Goober. Use, uh... This thing can own my team, guys. No freaking joke. Luckily, I was able to paralyze it, although she'll probably use a full restore when it gets close to low health. Sunny day. Ow. That didn't help. Okay, so it has Earthquake, so I'm gonna use another Max Survive. I have three of them, why not? Uh, and we're gonna go for a Light Screen for some reason, why not? Thunder! Wait, oh, oh. What do you mean it doesn't affect Garchomp? What is it, half flying? That's so annoying. Alright, whatever, at least we have this in the bag right here. So there we go, there's the champion. I'm speechless, you overpowered me so quickly, that was brilliant! Hey, there's the Zeri region, guys! All we have to do now is the Loren, and we're done with this playthrough. Now you conquered the Zeri lady, first thing I'll say is congratulations, you were sensational! Okay, who is this? One of them is floating. Blarg, that was amazing, I'm so proud of you. If your dad were here, he'd say the same thing. Congratulations, I'm so happy for you. Your mom and I came to cheer you on if you missed it. Blarg, it's time to enter your Pokemon in the Hall of Fame. Come with me. Do you recognize throughout the Pokemon world as a Pokemon master? Yay, here we go. Hall of Fame, Mother Freaker. Yes. Alright. There's still the lower region to go, so don't get too excited. Whoa, uh, I didn't even freaking get to see my Pokemon get entered in the Hall of Fame. And they're all dead. <laughs> Hardly. So, uh, that was pretty annoying. Okay. You're back! Congratulations on winning the Zeri League. Professor Jasmine wanted me to tell you to visit her lab. I think she wanted to ask you for a favor. Gee, I wonder what that favor might be. I didn't even get to see my Pokemon entered in the Hall of Fame. That's stupidly annoying and insane. Okay, so as usual, let's do our normal save. And our save state. Thank you. Alright, and back to the lab. You didn't even heal my Pokemon. I didn't get to see him get put in the Hall of Fame. What the freak? Hi, Blarg. I'm so happy you managed to beat Zeri at the Leap Forward. He's really a great Pokemon trainer. This is a historic achievement. However, your journey's not yet over. There are still eight gyms in an Elite Four in our neighboring region, the Lauren. After that, the World Championship! I told Professor Ellie, an old friend of mine, that she should be expecting you. Lauren Pass! Okay. Go to the Fort in Seanport. Oh, nice. I shall... I shall do that then. Yay! Half my party is dead. And I have nothing to show for it. Uh, yeah. Where's Seanport? Seanport, where are you? What is all this area down here? I've never even been down there. Seanport, that's Pokemon League, Stardust, other oh, Seanport. It's a weird place for a fort, or for a boat to Lauren. It's like in the middle of a Zeri map. Okay, now all my Pokemon are alive. Yay. And since I got the Lauren Pass, I think the ship is up in here. I've never been to I've never been to the Lauren region before, guys. So this is all new to me. Okay, I can't go through there even though I have a Lauren Pass. Nice. What about through here? This must be it. Um, ship's going to Lauren. Yes, please. Thank you. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, Lauren region. First steps. Yep. It's one thing you never saw an MCF playthrough, man. Didn't get to the Lauren region, but uh, here we are. House. That's real descriptive. What's in here? Anything of interest? Sutter Town. Mystic Water. Oh, Mystic Water. Actually, that might be useful. Mystic Water. Wait, that's okay. Good. It raises the power of water time. Let's see. Yes, please. I don't think I really need to grind anybody. Looking for Pupitar. Okay. You're not going to beat Lauren's Elite Four with a Pupitar, you know. So stupid. Yep, that's nice. Nobody cares. Pointless house is pointless. Moving on. I heard the Lauren region's better than the Zeri region. That'd be nice. Hi, Blarg. Professor Jasmine told me that one of the students would be coming to Lauren. I'm waiting for Yellow so we can get to my lab. Unlike you, he's just starting the Lauren League. I hope you two get along. Oh, God. Yellow. There's like a rival for every version, I swear. Okay. Um, I'm gonna cut out a second. Be right back. Sorry about that. Let's continue on. So apparently we've got Yellow, who's another rival. 
God forbid we don't even need more of them. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Everybody's house looks the same. Cool. Next. I don't even feel like talking to most of these people, honestly. Protein. Anything useful? Does anybody have anything useful to say? Anybody at all? What is that, a B2? Yep, that's cool. Yeah, okay. Useless dialogue is useless. What's over here? Super Potion! Yeah, I don't even need that late in the game. Eevee? Clearly level 40. Who are you kidding, man? What's up with a level drop right after Elite 4? You'd think they'd be at least 60. Hey, Pidgeot, no problemo, man. Easy, easy, easy. Yeah, alright. What is this? Wormhole level 34. Wow, it must suck for trainers here, man. They get, like, the level 5 Pokemon in the lab, and then they automatically get put against freaking level 34. <laughs> That's pretty funny, actually, in my opinion. You must not have a lot of trainers that survive here. That's all I gotta say about that. Cricketoon. Waterfall, motherfucker. No, no paralyzed. Bad. There we go. Okay, let's switch to somebody we haven't seen in a bit, or trained in a bit. We'll do Goober. Sounds good to me. Yeah, sure. Sure it is. Bugs of Lauren have incredible hidden strength, you don't say. Looks like the same- whoops. I just totally used Earthquake without thinking. I'm stupid. Okay. Scolipede. Nice. Have a Steel Wing. Have another Steel Wing, even though I know it's Steel and not Flying type attack. Pinsir! No, I'm a freaker. Thank you. All these Pokemon are so easy. There's like a level drop, man. What's up with that? Well, I guess it kind of makes sense in storyline terms because, you know, people start out in Lauren, pretty much. I mean, it's not like they come here after beating the Elite Four. Whatever, I guess. Next. Drifloon. Okay, whoops. I totally forgot about that. Okay, flamethrower. Glide, hey, they didn't get into anything to me, dude. Sorry. Flamethrower! Another flamethrower, thank you. Just die of burn already, thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah, okay, that's nice. Like, you haven't heard of me already. Cleanse tag, don't think I need it. Or do I? Let's see. Super po let's use a super potion on somebody, then we can get that cleanse tag. I forgot what it even does. It's like ghost type moves or something, isn't it? Oh, it helps with fall wilds. That's nice. That might be useful. Okay, so there's a gym here. That's nice. You've seen Suicune visit Lauren. That's cool, too. What's in this house? Anything useful? Quick Claw. Yeah, somebody else said that, I know. I know I have a very itchy turbo finger. I'm sure you're all probably used to it by now. Don't really need to go in there. Okay, because I still have plenty of items left over from the Elite Four. Yeah, yeah, shut up. Shut up. Nobody cares. Nope. No, it's not, kid. This time, she just asked uh, if it was possible for a child to catch a Pokemon. I said, nope, no, it's not, kid. You should just give up on your dreams. Okay, so that's a research laboratory, that's cool. Thank you. Don't know what's over that way. Let's just talk to Ellie. Sure. Sounds like a plan. There's still a storyline in this or something, I'd assume. Hello, Blarg! This is my nephew Yellow and my niece Pearl. They'll be journeying through- Pearl? What is there, diamond somewhere too? We're probably gonna have like five million more rivals this- this uh, region just because of freaking. We had five million rivals last region. Uh, and welcome to the lower region. You may choose. You and Pearl will choose the other. Oshawott. Uh, wow, okay, so you get the black and white starters. That's nice. But I can't. I need to freaking... Okay, maybe it goes to my box. Let's see. Do I want a Samurad, a Tepig, or a Superior? Um, I get a Superior. Thank you. I mean, I had a Superior in my black and white, so... Yeah, that's pretty epic. I love Superior. It's one of the best Grass-type starters, in my opinion. What is this? What's up here? I don't even know what that is. What level is this? Is it like level 5 or something? 
In a place with level 30 wilds, that would make any sense. Okay, let's see. Level 15, not terrible. Eh, maybe if I feel like it, I can rare candy it up. Um, but right now, I think my team is good enough as is, so maybe I should just leave it. I think I'm good. What do you got? Oh, uh, Ivysaur, nice. I have a flamethrower. What's over this way? Okay, so I can't go over that way for some reason. Okay, so apparently they give you the black and white starters. That's pretty epic, actually. I like that. But I'm not going to use any of them because I am comfortable with my party on this. Earthquake, Mother Freaker. Earthquake again, Mother Freaker. Thank you. What's up here? Super Potion. Yeah, I don't need any of those. Who's that? Pearl up there? Or Diamond, whatever? I don't care. Oh, wait, no, Diamond was in last region, wasn't he? I don't know. What? What do you mean, can't get away? You gotta be kidding me. Run. Hypno? Bah, big deal. Earthquake! Thank you. What is this? Luxury Ball! Run! For ugly. Oh, wait, no, blame me out, my bad. Run, who are you? Who are you, lady? Oh, it is Pearl. I was looking for stronger Pokemon battles, but I'll fight you with what I have. Oh, good. Something actually worth fighting. Why does it only have Ember at level 63, though? That's so stupid. Skeptile. Yeah, I can beat it with a uh, Flamethrower. Luckily, at least the Rivals levels are up to date. <laughs> Yay. Okay, the Gyms of Lauren have got to be semi-hard, I assume. And I think it wants me to go this way now. So that's what I'll do. Hey, Shroomish, nice, I don't give a crap. If I were to use any grass type in this playthrough, it would be superior, trust me. I know I said I don't really like using Pokemon more than once uh, in my playthroughs, but superior is worth it. Yes, I know how to battle. Who are you kidding? Earthquake, easy as that. Don't know how to rap. Yes, no you don't. Revive, I'm gonna save real quick, uh, just in case. Thank you. Maybe I should have gotten Embor, I don't know. Ah, it doesn't matter, I'm not gonna use any of them anyways. Plus I have Arch Canine, why would I want an Embor? Yay! Polyrath, have a Body Slam. Oh god dang it, I would have put myself to sleep anyways. And why do you have Rock, only Water Gun? I mean, seriously. Traders in this region are incredibly underleveled. Yeah, I guess they wanted the rivals to seem strong or something. This is just weird, it's like you're starting out in this region, yet everything's level 30 to 60. Yes, I know how to fight, dude. Who are you kidding? Have an earthquake. No, don't hurt yourself. God dang it. I mean, you think people would have heard of me because I freaking just beat the Elite Four of the Zeri region. I mean, seriously. Next. Who do you think I are? You must be the Zeri champion. I'm Silver from Johto. Silver. Oh, God. Uh, do they have a rival for every version? This is ridiculous. Is there one for trading card game, too? <laughs> and pinball? And stadium? <laughs> oh, it looks like he has the same party as gold, probably. Meganium? Oh, that's new. Okay, Meganiums are usually very annoying, so you have to be very careful with them. Have a body slam. No solar beam for you, buddy. For alligator, get out of here, Anubis. Time to take down a for alligator. Silver is already stronger than gold, go figure. Why haven't any of these people beaten the Elite Four yet? Of course I do. I think you need to keep training, because while you're very strong, many trainers will challenge you for your title. Okay, so he's obviously heard that I've uh, beaten the Zeri League already. Well, that's good. At least that's realistic. Uh, okay. Run. What? What do you mean you can't run? Hurry up. Dang it. Call me, honey. What do you have, a Vespa Quinn? Oh, Aria knows. Okay. Well, that's fine, too. Ah, uh, no, it's not. No, it is not. What's up with all the super potions? That's so weird. Actually, we might be able to beat the first Jim and Lauren <laughs> in the same episode as I beat the Elite Four, so that'll be cool. Yeah, yeah, nobody cares. Uh, what's, uh, yeah. wonder what uh, Pokemon this Jim is uh, made of here. Does anybody have anything interesting to say or an item to give me? Because I really don't give a crap about anything else. Ugh, my god. Aerodactyl? Okay. Door is locked. Can I go in there? Oh, that's a gym. 
Okay, so I gotta go to the mine to face the shell. That's nice. Where's the mine? Is this the mine? Okay, that might be the mine. I'm gonna heal first, though, of course. We have five minutes left. Maybe we can beat Rochelle within that time. Turbo for the win. TM49. Hey, Rock Slide. That'll be fairly useless, probably, but let's see. Rock Slide. Who can learn it, anyway? Nobody? <laughs> useless. I think this is uh, flying a rock or something. I don't know. Hey, cool, I got a fossil, gee, I wonder where to go to get it, you know, revived. Maybe it's in here. Yeah, all these places look the same. Okay, who do I talk to to get my freaking fossil at the date? Seriously. Uh, I, I can't, I don't even know. <laughs> There's nobody in here that'll revive my fossil, huh? I'm probably just turboing through it, but I don't care. Let's see. Copper ore, huh? Get out of the way, buddy. There's an item there. If you don't get out of the way, I will not be able to get it. Please move, you dummy. Thank you. Spiral fo- okay, so I have two fossils. I wonder where I get them, uh, revived. No, so, this part of the job is done. I just that was a nice little jumping machine there. You extra I'm Rochelle, the Rock Rockavelli City Gym Leader. Sorry, I have to go to the refinery now. Okay, so we're going to the refinery. Nice. Is she in here? Hello, Rockavelli. There you are. Oh Rochelle, I'm sorry, Rockavelli's the city. What do you want me to hurry so you can challenge me to the gym? Hold your horses. I'll be back in the gym in a minute. Yeah, the work's done, I'll head back. Okay, so I guess they troll you there and make you say no uh, when you just want her to hurry. <laughs> well, whatever. Let's go to the gym. Yay! Save first of all. I mean, I'm saving as much as I am in uh, Spirit Gold, even though this place thing isn't gonna glitch, but uh, yeah, doesn't matter. All right, let's go to the gym, yay. Since I'm guessing this is- this looks just like the ground gym, are you serious, man? Why doesn't this game have any variety in it? I'm sorry, I don't mean to rage. I don't mean to rage and I don't mean any disrespect to the creators, but... There is no variety to these gyms, it's boring. Ugh. Ugh, whatever, have an earthquake, dead. There we go. Okay, right on, you get an earthquake too. Scary face or really not that scary, buddy. Just let you know. And you're dead. Yeah, yeah. Go to the judge. Who are you? Steelix? Earthquake, mother freaker. All these guys are so easy. Ugh. It's like a breath of fresh air after facing the lead four. Who are you? Aerodactyl? Okay. That's fine. Welcome to the Rockabilly City Gym. As a leader, I use the strongest fossil Pokemon to defeat any trainer. Interesting. Okay, Armaldo. That's interesting. Have a body slam, Armaldo. Have another one, Armaldo. There we go. That's dead, Armaldo. Bastiodon. I think I'll want to send out Shellyon. Ice Beam. Okay, that didn't help me at all. Waterfall. Okay, there we go. Yay! That was quick. Shelly should be able to sweep the rest of this team. That's an interesting Aerodactyl Sprite, and that was easy as heck. <laughs> I see a brilliant future for you, Keep. What do you mean? I'm already the freaking Zeri League champion. Are you kidding me? Now that you beat me, I'll give you the first badge of the Lauren League. The Mineral Badge! <laughs> Yay, Mineral Badge! Can you use Rock Climb? Yay. Oh, that is Rock Climb. Nice. Do I even have anybody that can... Legion can learn it? Are you serious? That's weird. Rock Climb's only 50-80, so I think I'll forget that. No. No. Yes, no rock climb. Okay, let's take a look at the shiny new badge. Uh, which apparently I can't see. <laughs> so I guess I'll just have to make up what the badge looks like in order to put it on my sidebars. Anyways, we're coming to the end of this video, so rate, comment, subscribe, favorite, and see you guys next time.